Hi everybody, I'm Judson Althoff and I'm delighted to be here with Rod Schrader, the Chairman and CEO of Komatsu America. Uh, and we want to talk a little bit about how they're leveraging di digital technology uh, to really leapfrog and advance the company forward. So let's maybe start off a little bit, um, just high level, talking about Komatsu. We're a global company. We've got uh, 60,000 employees. Focus is construction and, and mining industries and we're supporting our customers in over 200 countries. We've been a leader in autonomous mining trucks. Uh, we introduce smart construction. We're really focusing on technology solutions. Got it. So we spend a lot of time uh, in our industry these days talking about digital transformation, and it's you know, probably the most overused term in the industry right now. Um, and it's, it's uh, ironically sometimes the, the least understood. W what does it really mean for Komatsu? You know, our, our heritage is manufacturing expertise, efficiency, and excellence. We're familiar with utilizing data from a manufacturing engineering standpoint, we've got to now transform our business by connecting it to our, our dealer network yeah. and our customers to, to add that value. direction you're headed in in terms of becoming a, a more of a solution provider versus just a product company. Um, the, the aspect of not only uh, selling the original product to market, but continuing that serviceability relationship throughout time. Talk to us a little bit about um, the strategy. You know, rental is becoming a bigger piece of our business. So that puts the burden back on the, the dealer and, the, and the, the, the OE to make sure that that product is properly maintained. We don't have enough people to follow every single machine, but that data exists and we can manage that most effectively to optimize the utilization of the asset, um, the health of, of, of the asset, and then eventually that product gets sold into the used market and the better maintained it is, the higher the value of that. Sort of pretty cutting edge in a lot of things yeah. with uh, autonomous and semi-autonomous equipment as well as like even using drone technology. Um, talk to us about the future. Like where do you, where do you see uh, tech like that uh, driving your business? Probably about three or four years ago. I, I, I try to spend a lot of a big portion of my time going out and talking to, to customers. And I had a contractor tell me a couple years ago, he said, you know, Rod. I get paid the same amount of money today to move a yard of dirt that I did in 1970s. Wow. And you think about that, the inflationary aspects of every, all his other input costs have, have gone through the roof. So how do we make our customers more efficient? And you know, uh, we introduced first a machine called IMC, Intelligent Machine Control fly the drone, take the 3D data models, put them in the machine and make the machine more efficient. And that's for you know, leveling uh, material, digging a hole, our, our dozers and excavators. Once then we got that going, we found out there's a limit to us improving the productivity of the job site because there's other inputs that have nothing to do with the Komatsu product. Delivering asphalt and concrete and pipes and things like that that if we really truly improve the overall job site efficiency, we have to think beyond just our product, we have to think of the entire customer process. And partners like Microsoft help in that, putting that kind of platform in place. Awesome, really cool. Well, Rod, thank you so much for spending some time with us here. I think that the direction you're headed in is an impressive one, and, and we're really thankful to be your partner on this journey. And we're, we're thankful for your collaboration and partnership. Great. Thanks, Rod. Appreciate it.